your shame you shall have double and for confusion they shall rejoice in their portion therefore in their land they shall possess the double everlasting joy shall be unto them welcome back to waffle ministries dr angela here i'm so excited to have you here welcome to the broadcast wherever you're tuning in from around the globe i love you with the love of christ jesus loves you so much never forget that Listen here under the sound of my voice. Many of you are about to be famous. You didn't ask for fame. You're not looking for it. You're not even looking for that amount of money. But God says, I'm favoring you in this due season. And it's going to happen so quick. It's going to happen so fast that your head is going to swim. You're not going to be able to keep up with the blessings that's about to hit you. This is your Amos 9 and 13 moment. Get ready. God says in Ephesians 3.20, I will do exceedingly exceedingly and abundantly above all that you could ever ask or think according to the power that work it in us. God is about to do something for you that your eyes have not seen, your ears have not heard of it. Get ready, get ready because you are walking into a season that you do not know. It's very unfamiliar to you. It's foreign to you because you never had that much money. You never been famous. But some of you, you are getting literally pushed to the forefront. God is literally, he's calling you out. He says, come out in the monks, but he's putting you up in front of mighty great kings and queens, my God. And he's favoring you in this due season. And God says, for your shame, you shall have double. For confusion, you shall rejoice in your portion. And he's giving you fame for the shame that you have been through. You've cried a lot of tears. You suffered a lot of nights. You have to fight unseen battles that nobody knows about. But God said, what I'm doing for you in this season, my God, you are going to testify. You've cried tears of pain. You've cried tears of suffering. But God said, in this due season, you're about to cry tears of joy. You will testify of the goodness of the Lord. God said, I'm doing a three. 60 in your life is working together for your good. The enemy was trying to tell you that the blessing is not going to happen. The miracle won't come, but miracle signs and wonders happen to those who believe and a miracle is about to happen to you. God is about to turn your situation around. My God, so get ready, get excited for it. My God, you are walking into the best days of your life. God is elevating you, increasing you in every area of your life. I would encourage you to sow into this word today. Hear me by the spirit. Your life is about to change right before your very own eyes. My God, I love you, family. And remember, the joy of the Lord is your strength. God bless you.